Hi. I make you better, that's what I do. Uh, I wanted to make a little bit of a short piece here. In the below video, we have Sakal, a PGA certified instructor, uh, instructing people to uh, have a per perfect takeaway start by pushing up with the left foot. The problem for Zach Allen is that this is not happening. I mean, he shows you Bryson and Rory McIlroy telling you that's what they're doing. He even has those fancy pressure plates and showing his pressure was up. The problem is it's not happening that way. My instruction is different because, you know, I found that people were misinformed and people teaching golf, you know, teaching two pros and so on, don't really understand the golf swing, which means that the instruction won't work. So, if you try what he's telling you, this guy, Zach Allen, in the below video, it won't work. What actually happens in the sequence of, you know, the sort of the takeaway, is that your right side is going to pressure down into your right heel and right hip. So, you're actually going to start moving into the right heel and hip by going down, not to the right. You're not going to move to the right because that won't work either. You have to move down. Once you move down with the right side, then your left foot will want to push off like that. But that's not what Zach Allen was teaching. If you watch the below video, you'll find that he didn't teach that because he doesn't know. And I found that teaching people in golf and other places is that one, you have to explain how things actually works in the golf swing and how the body is supposed to move and uh, explain it because you are misinformed by hundreds of years basically yeah, information that's not correct. And that's a problem because now you struggle. You don't know why you struggle because you're, doing, you're trying to do what they teach you, but it doesn't work. So this instruction does not work. It's 100% wrong. Now, the issue with the 100%, if you're 100% wrong is that people have a hard time accepting that someone like a PGA certified teacher would teach something that's 100% wrong because a lot of people try this stuff that they go like, but they must know what they're doing. And I said, no, they don't. They only teach you what they know and they don't know. So they can't teach them. My instruction works because I did all this homework to find out how it actually works. And then I have to design an instruction set that did work without this kind of, let's call it misinformation, lack of knowledge, like I understand whatever you call it because I don't like to teach guesswork conceptual teachings and then when you you know make a case for something that's supposed to happen it's not happening then uh, you know well I can understand why you and everybody else is in trouble either you feel a true pro or an amateur they teach you stuff they don't understand and then you can do it and the problem is that people have learned to accept that that they can't do it, then they form the opinion of, you know, golf must be difficult. And then you accept that, and at some point you accept it's gonna be difficult. So if someone like myself comes and teach you and it's basically not that difficult, people go, well, it's supposed to be. Not with me.